Travel video. Fred and Derek here from New York. The city is so nice, they named it twice. We are going on a street food tour and we're taking a big bite of the Big Apple. In this exciting episode, we will tour street food in Manhattan, New York. Make sure you watch this video till the end. We'll share delicious experiences such as Puerto Rican arepas and crispy pork, Jamaican oxtail, dirty rice, and sweet plantains, man. Chinese carved Peking duck and shashu bun sandwiches. headed on to 48th Street. There seems to be a, a food festival I want to go ahead and take advantage of. I think there's going to be lots of food stalls and lots of great eating. All right, let's go. Hey guys, it's me, Derek Pesquale. I'm with my dad, Frederick Pesquale. Uh, we are right now in the middle of 8th Street right now. Uh, as you guys can see behind us, there's a lot of booths and in front of us, so is there too. Uh, where you can buy clothes, uh, merch, and sometimes food. That corn on the cup and a lot of other stuff. have them blend fruit and make a smoothie. Freshly cut fruit, refreshing. You can't buy half of this, but you can buy smoothies. Have a juicy day. So we're in front of our very first booth. We had to order the smoothie from uh, this, this um, it's called a smoothie bubble tea. Well, actually it's called smooth, just smooth. So what they do is they pick out these fresh fruits and they put obviously some ice and it's just all natural. Let's see how it tastes. Very refreshing. I mean, it doesn't seem like there's anything added to it. It's just, just the normal. It's just that fresh fruit, right? Fresh fruit, nice and cold, with uh, with mix of that ice, right? Very nice. All right, this one is the strawberry. Let me try this one. Yeah, that's definitely strawberry. No sugar added to it. It's just the sweetness directly from the strawberry. Awesome. You can't get this at Olive Garden. The smell of Puerto Rican food. I'm muy rico. Wepa. We're in front of Oscar Arepas. So we're gonna try uh, some lechon. We have some nice lechon, crispy. He just fried that off. And it looks like it comes in one piece and then he chopped it up in di different pieces, so bite sizes. And then he's got some guacamole hot sauce. That's spicy. And then we also have some, some corn patty. Okay, we'll try that too as well. So we're gonna go ahead and put a little bit of this uh, guacamole here. Guacamole hot sauce. Oh. Oh, 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 wow. Super crispy. You got that salty, fatty taste of this. It tastes really fresh. Next one I'm going to try here is this corn. And I'm just going to pick that one up. All right, this one is the corn. Oh my God, that's really hot. I'm gonna try a bite. Mmm. With the corn flavor, crispy, still a little chewy too, and some farts. Oh, very good. And now we're gonna go on to other stalls in a second here while I finish up what we have here. Hey, man, Jamaican me hungry. Next up, some Caribbean cuisine. 
slowly roasted oxtail, delicious dirty rice, and caramelized sweet plantains. Yeah, man. They had chicken, oxtail, a bunch of other different meats. What we got today, I love oxtail, and I love it when it's uh, cooked for a very long time. The lady said it; she cooks it for at least two hours, and it also comes with dirty rice too as well. Okay. So what I actually ordered today is we have plantains, and we also have uh, some oxtail. So. Actually, when I put my fork into it, it's very soft and moist. I can tell that. It's going to be a very good experience. So let's see how this tastes. Mmm. All right. So you can taste that fattiness from the uh, from the oxtail, and you can also taste that there's it's a little somewhat sweet type of taste. Um, I think it's the marinade that they use for this. A little sweet. And it is very soft and moist. So, oh wow. Very good, very good flavor. And then we got the, the dirty rice. Let me try that separately. Dirty rice it has a little tomatoey taste to it. Um, there is some beans. The plantain. Let me try a little piece of that. And it's, it's very soft um, and it's very tender. And what I'm gonna try to do here, I'm gonna try a little bit of each. I'm gonna try some of the rice, try some of the meat, and then I'll have all three here. That's it. Wow, nice combination. Rice, you got that fatty from the oxtail. It's all very moist from uh, the meat of the oxtail is fall off the bone. That kind of melts in your mouth a little bit. And then you have that sweet. It already has a little bit of sweet flavor to it, uh, to the oxtail, but with the plantain, awesome taste. Wish I could slow down. Wish I could I'll stop the world and melt with you. Vanilla ice, ice, baby. Yeah, what is this old stuff here? Wish I could slow down. Wish I could stop time. Wish I could slow. Peking duck is from Chinese Yuan Dynasty in the 1200s. The shu is slightly charred honey glazed Chinese barbecued pork. We just got a couple of items. You, can, you saw earlier how they made it. They're chopping up the uh, the char shu and they dip it into this honey and then they put it in the sandwich along with cucumbers. And then we have another one here. We ordered the Peking duck. And uh, they have Peking duck with crispy skin, also with the uh, cucumber and also on the steamed bun as well. And you can see the sauce that they have on for the uh, for the duck is hoisin sauce. And then the other one is, it looks like they put hoisin in there as well, but uh, they dipped it into that honey uh, batter too as well. This one is the Peking duck and wow, it is steaming hot. And you saw earlier, uh, they were cutting up, they were cutting up a whole Peking duck. And let's, get, let's see how this tastes. I didn't know that cucumber, how that cucumber is gonna play, but that combination of the um, the roasted duck with the, the steam bun and that refreshing cucumber, what a spectacular combination! But this is a pork. They call it pork char shu, but for for them they just call it pork barbecue, and it does have also the same combination with the cucumber and the steam bun. Oh yeah. Wow. 
heard a lot of Sharshu and this probably has to be up there with them. Hope you enjoyed our New York Street Festival video and don't forget to click that like and please share our video. Also hit that subscribe button and that bell icon as we will be releasing more You Me Food Travel videos. Thank <laughs> you.